What is one thing come first to your mind after being rejected? Fellow Toastmasters, friends, guests, good evening. I'm here standing in front of you sharing about rejection. Rejection is part is more valuable than an action. All that I have learned is because of rejection. Year 2009, 2008, when I was in the Philippines, I was rejected by our neighbors because I'm trying to borrow money for the hospitalization of my eldest daughter. But they rejected me. It's hurt because being a mother, you don't want to see your children or your daughter suffering from any pains. Instead of getting mad to my neighbors, I comfort myself. It's okay not to be okay sometimes. Not every day is a good day, but there is good in every day. Everything happens for a reason. Let's start with feelings. If you get rejected, acknowledge it to yourself. Don't try to brush off the hurt or pretend it's not painful. Instead of thinking, I shouldn't feel this way, think about how normal it is for you to feel like you have given your situation normal how intense your feelings are. Rejection and failure is part of the process. It is part of our life that if you don't experience rejection, you will not learn. And if you don't learn, you will not grow. You will not change. Year 2019, when I was a member and top contributor of one of the famous Facebook group, I shared inspirational quote daily and this post got thousand likes. But one day, I couldn't find this group. I feel sad because I really love what I am doing. I took a break from Facebook for a week. Then, when I come back, I decided to create my own Facebook page, Wings of Inspiration. Why Wings of Inspiration? Because my failure, my pains, my rejection inspired me to continue what have I started. I have from I have learned from these experiences and I shared it to my followers and you know when you love what you are doing the result will follow. I have learned this and you know rejection will teach us to unlock your gifts, your talents, and abilities that you thought you wouldn't have. I learned from my rejection to trust myself, to stand on my own feet and not to depend, and not to depend, no, not always to depend to anybody. Rejection. I have, through my rejection, I have learned to trust myself. And whatever life throws at us, and whatever people say negative about us, just keep going. You can survive. 
whatever life throws at you. And don't just keep going and don't give up. No, just keep working on your dreams because your dreams is possible. No matter how hard your dream is, just keep working on it because the hardest the battle, the sweetest the victory. I mean it, saying, I have not done my best yet. Thank you.